This video is going to show you how to place students in instructional groups in Renaissance Learning. You can do this for STAR Reading Enterprise, STAR Math Enterprise, and STAR Early Literacy Enterprise. For demonstration purposes, I'm going to be using STAR Reading Enterprise. So the first thing I want to do is expand this section. Then I'm going to click on Record Book. Once in Record Book, I'm going to select my class. Then I'm going to select a benchmark. If you teach in a grade level in K through 2, be sure to select District Benchmark. But if you teach at a level from grades 3 through 8, select Kentucky K Prep as your benchmark. Be sure to select Scores Descending so you can, score, you can sort your scale scores for your students. The next thing you want to do is click Edit Instructional Groups. By default, it will show you four instructional groups that you could place your students in. If you need more, simply click the drop-down box and you can select up to ten instructional groups. When placing your students in instructional groups, you need to look at your scale score and any other data that you may have. Keep in mind that students in an instructional group will be placed with skills on the median. So therefore, all green may not need to be together in an instructional group. All students in blue may not be to be together, and so on and so forth. Since 976 is not close to the next sales score, I'm going to place the student in an instructional group by themselves. Then I'm going to look at the next few students. Since the range of the next two are very close, I'm going to place them together. Then I'm going to continue to build my instructional groups until every student is in one. Now that all of my students are placed in a group, I'm going to scroll down to the bottom and click Save. Once saved, you will now see a number beside all students that are in an instructional group and what their group number is. So now what we want to do is come back to the top and click Sort by Instructional Groups. This will divide all of your students into the groups that they're in. The next step is for planning for, the, for each group. In order to do this, you can look at View Suggested Skills above any group. Once you click that, it will take you into Record Book. And this will tell you what skills each student is ready to learn. Be sure to come over to the side and click any subdomain to know which skills students are ready for. Once you find a skill that you're ready to teach the group, you can simply click on it and it will expand and show you the instructional resources. If you click Skill Probe, this will be a quick assessment tool that you could use for your students. If there is a teacher activity, you can open that up and that will be a lesson plan for you to use.